Are you wondering why dogs kick up the grass after pooping or basically scratch at the ground? Well, I was curious too, so I brought on Dr. Reinhard to answer that question today, coming up. Hey everybody, welcome to the Boston Terrier Society YouTube channel. Consider subscribing if you're someone who wants to learn more about the breed, learn what it's like to be an owner, hear expert interviews, as well as connect with other Boston Terrier lovers just like yourself. I'm Donnie Gardner, the founder of bostonterriersociety.com. Over there is Bella, my Boston over 10 years, and if you're very quiet, you can hear her snoring. ever so gently. Okay, today I think is a really interesting video because every now and again, Bella, whenever I take her potty, she'll just start scratching at the ground. And you know, this is something obviously other dogs do and everything, but I was curious, like why do dogs, like dogs in general do this? And then specifically, why do Boston Terriers do it? Once again, pretty much all dogs do this. And I wanted to bring on Dr. Reinhard to answer that question for us. So without further ado, Dr. Reinhard, thanks for coming on the show today. Hey Donnie, it's good to be back on the Boston Terrier Society YouTube channel. So I wanted to know, like from time to time, Bella kicks up grass after pooping. I know all dogs do this, but like Boston Terrier specifically, like why do dogs do this? It's actually a really interesting question, Donnie. So the short answer is that this is the way they're marking their territory. The long answer is that in the wild, canines or dogs seem to be territorial. So they mark areas uh, with their scent from their urine and stool. In addition, dogs actually have scent glands on their feet where they secrete pheromones uh, or scent. These pheromones leave the scent so that other dogs know um, that your dog was here. So by kicking the feet, it leaves a lot of the scents on the ground to let other dogs know that this is actually their territory. In addition, the actual kicking behavior, which other dogs can see, will also let other dogs know that this is their territory. So Boston Terriers, because they are canines uh, and evolved with these scent glands in their feet, will do this behavior to mark their territory after going to the bathroom. Now, should we stop our Boston Terriers if they're doing this? Or is there even a way to stop it? So this is actually a pretty harmless behavior and you shouldn't be overly concerned about it. In fact, um, my female Greyhound does this all the time. I guess the most annoying part about it is that sometimes when you're on a walk and your dog is like kicking a lot in someone else's grass, it can damage the grass and it can even damage the grass in your own yard. I don't really think there's a great way to stop this behavior um, because it's a pretty normal behavior in dogs. So I don't usually recommend discouraging it. If it seems to be causing a lot of damage to your yard, um, try and fence off a designated area in your yard or take your dog to the park where they can kick around on the ground without causing too much damage. If they're causing too much damage, another approach you might do is offer your dog a treat uh, right after they go to the bathroom. If you can distract them with their favorite treat right after they go potty, they might skip out on that scratching of the grass. Okay, well thanks. I think this is really interesting and thanks for coming on the show today. Thank you so much, Donnie. It's been great speaking with you again. Okay, I hope this was insightful for you. I know it was interesting for me. Once again, Dr. Reinhardt had mentioned this is a natural thing that dogs do. So as far as stopping it, it's not really necessary. But if you do wanna stop it, just go back and watch some of the examples that Dr. Reinhardt had mentioned as far as ways you can help to avoid your Boston Terrier from doing this. Question of the day, what would you like to have answered about your dog? Put it in the comments below. I'd love to see if I can bring on an expert to answer your questions. No matter what it is, just go ahead and put the question down below because I'm curious to see what you guys come up with. Now, if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to the Boston Terrier Society YouTube channel just so you can get the latest from us. If you wanna learn more about Boston Terriers, definitely check out this video that I created here, 20 Reasons Why Boston Terriers Are the Best Dog Breed in America, or one of my latest videos here. And as always, till next time, life is better with a Boston.